This is Code Combat. I'm currently working on Computer Science 2, Python version, level 29, Tomb Ghost. Goal, defeat the ogre munchkins, practice using a parameter, which is the target, uh, the word target, passed into a function, right? So this is where we tell the computer hit and run enemy. And so then it runs our function, hit and run, and enemy now equals target. So then it says, okay, does enemy exist? attack enemy. Let's try this out. Define our definition of hit or hide. If target exists, so we want if target is what we're going to be checking if it exists. So we're asking the computer if target, and if the computer says true, target's a thing, then we'll run whatever's below this. So if target exists, attack, then, then move to the red mark. Okay. So we would want to move back to here, which I think is 3217. So x hero dot move x y, and I said 32 space 17. All right. So now, when remember when we hit run, the computer does not run what is in the function. It looks for code that it can run. While true, it will run this, and then it says, "All right, hero, find the nearest enemy." And whatever my hero finds, that is now named enemy. If my hero finds nothing, enemy will equal nothing. Then we call hit or hide with my enemy as an argument, my enemy variable. So then the computer says hit or hide, what's that mean? Zoop. Oh, I'm going to run this, hit or hide, target. Okay, so target is the enemy. If target, okay, does the enemy exist? If so, it runs this code. If not, it skips it, hits the bottom of our function, and it's like, I'm done, I'm done, hits the bottom of our loop, and repeats. Let's uh, test. Awesome. So here's that code that worked for me. Great, let's keep going. 